you guys Ben here and welcome back to another video on Supergirl season 6. Today we got some breaking new news about the series finale which they are currently filming right now in Vancouver. So if you do go on to enjoy the video please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year. Okay so this is the video I've been waiting to make for years. Now we haven't seen this specific character for a long time. The last time he showed up was in a actual cameo appearance during the 100th episode last year, but that wasn't like an official thing. It was in the past, it wasn't like in the present day, right? So I don't think that necessarily counts. It was a cameo, but it wasn't anything much more than that. So the last time this character appeared like properly in present day was when he left for the future and I'm sure you guys know who I'm talking about from the title and everything but we're talking about Monel and uh, yeah Chris Wood was back on the set and he is back as Monel for the series finale of Supergirl. The series finale obviously means the final episode ever and so they were filming last night and this is where we got some photos this is all coming from Canada Graphs so go check out his Twitter at Canada Graphs that's going to be in the description below along with his Patreon where you can get these photos that I'm going to be popping up on the screen and also go over to his blog page because he's going to be having a post out on this set in a couple of days time there'll be more photos there when that does release so now let's freak out about this because it's been it's been a video I've been waiting to make for a long time because as you guys know after Supergirl my favorite character definitely is mon and so I mean the last time he was properly around was in season 3 the ending when he went back to the future to join or rejoin the Legion of Superheroes and so there was a teaser at the end that he would one day come back and with him living in Vancouver right now due to obviously quarantine and everything and like Melissa and Chris just had a kid so obviously they're not going to be like separated at all so we kind of presumed with him in Vancouver he was going to show up at some point in Supergirl's final season and yes it has finally happened so let's go ahead and go to the set photos so this was of obviously the series finale and you can see we have like a bunch of set photos but this is the one that has everyone talking. Obviously they're getting the makeup done here and there were some other ones released online by Pursuit23. I'm sure some of you follow him on Twitter. But anyway so they were on the set and they got photos of Melissa and Chris as Kara and Monel reunited. Now this is awesome. We've been speculating that maybe at the end of the season, which is literally this episode they're filming, that Kara is probably going to go away and maybe go to the future with Monel and obviously reunite, but they're reuniting in the present. So it turns out Wynn and Monel have come back in the past for a funeral. Now, whose funeral is this? Well, I have a strong idea that it's going to be one specific character because. I'm just going to quickly list out like who is on the set and everyone that was there because it pretty much gives you a good idea because you have to think in common like who do they all know that is not filming right there. So we have Alex, we have Jean, we have Lena, we have Nia, Kelly, Supergirl, Brainy, Andrea, Monel, Wynn and James Olsen. So that is three returning characters, a big triple whammy all in one go. Yes, we're going to be seeing the return of Makar Brooks, Jeremy Jordan and Chris Wood in this episode. And now what do all these characters have in common? Well, I would say the only real obvious answer is Cat Grant. So is it possible that Cat Grant is the one who has died and that's why Monel and Wynn have come back to the past and James has returned from wherever James has been. I think this is the most likely person that it could be. Obviously I don't know under the circumstances like why she has died or whoever this person is if it doesn't turn out to be Cat Grant. I presume something bad happened or maybe it was just natural but in their line of work I don't know I feel like something worse probably went down. However it's been said that the finale is going to be quite hopeful in the way that it ends so I guess there is going to be maybe a twist that she wasn't like killed by a villain or something like that but it was natural and this was just a way for the whole team to reunite but yeah let's talk about the photos so I woke up this morning I saw the photos Chris Wood is back as Monel I freaked out when I saw it and I've been thinking about it all day since so you can see he's here he's obviously got the classic Monel beard 
and he is suited up in a funeral suit. And same goes for Kara, so Melissa is all dressed up in black and it does seem like her hair is a bit darker. I don't know if that's because she hasn't been dying it, but nevertheless it is awesome to see them reunited and filming together. Obviously they live with each other day to day, but like it's so cool to imagine them reuniting because it's been such a long time and I don't know if they're going to play it out as we want it to, like is Caramel actually going to be a thing or not, but either way it's awesome. And so we have this other photo from Canada Graphs, you got David on the far left, you got Melissa, she's reenacting something to Kyla that they did before, Chris is laughing, and you've got Jeremy right here standing next to them. And then if we go on to some more photos, we have a photo of David and Kyla. They're messing around obviously between takes, all of this is. Also Jesse Raff is here and he's in his full green attire. So, I mean, pretty much for most of the season, I think he's going to be keeping his green look. And we have the return of McCard Brooks as James Olsen. That is super exciting. Obviously he's here with Kelly and you can see Andrea in the background. So McCard looks awesome and he is obviously returning and I think he's one of the big giveaways because if James is returning he's one of the people that has a really strong connection with Cat Grant and he would come back 100% for that so what do you guys think about that now obviously we have the return of Monel in this episode and we have the return of Win shot that is super exciting they are two characters like I said earlier went off to the future and so they're definitely time traveling and coming back this episode. And so that's where we're gonna find them where we kick off. And I think, you know, one of the best kind of trios, I guess you could call it, throughout Supergo's run was definitely them all together. Like Monel and Wynn were amazing whenever they were on screen together. They had many memorable scenes. So naturally fans are gonna be super excited, just like myself. And we were actually speculating like, is Jeremy going to come back? Is Chris going to come back? We were all pretty set that Chris was going to come back because, like I said earlier, he lives in Vancouver. But Jeremy and McCard, they don't live in Vancouver. So they've obviously made the trip because they know it's the final episode. Like, we're never going to be able to do this again. So let's go back, risk it. Let's do the quarantine. And we're going to be in this final episode because, you know, we've been in the show. We were here since the start even though we did leave. I guess I was kind of worried that they wouldn't show up because of the circumstances around the world but nevertheless it is amazing to see them back. And so make sure to leave your opinions on all of this in the comments down below. Obviously Canada Graphs is going to have a bigger vlog on this in the next couple of days and the photos give an idea of you know what they were wearing and the circumstances that they are reuniting in. But a big question that people are going to have going into this episode with the return of Wynn and mon is going to be in regards to like how Supergirl is going to end and if Supergirl is going to officially become a Legionnaire. Obviously we're going to make more videos on this over the next couple of days and as we get closer to the series finale. But the last time that mon properly saw Supergirl at the end of Season 3, he gave her a Legion ring and although she hasn't used it much since then, it's been heavily teased that at one point she's going to become a Legion member. Obviously the main inspiration behind creating the Legion in the future is Supergirl. Obviously in the comics it's Switch and that's Superman. But in the TV show it's Supergirl so it would be very fitting if she goes off and becomes a Legionnaire. And what happens if she is recruited when they come back to the past in this episode? Obviously we can theorize about like how exactly is it going to end? Is she going to go to the future or is she going to be like a Legion member in the past and maybe mon stays in the past and Wynn stays in the past? But it's more likely than not that they're all going to go to the future because I would suggest that they probably have their own lives there by now. Like we don't know the time gap that it's been because obviously time isn't relative in the future and Remember last time it was seven months of Supergirl, but it was seven years for mon since they last saw each other. So this time it could be even shorter, it could be a bigger gap, like there could be some long lost time between that where say Wynn has a whole new life, say mon has a whole new life, or maybe they don't have a whole new life, maybe they're just the same old person they were but a legionnaire in the future. So with them coming back to the past, it isn't much of a difference from who they were before. 
But thank you guys so much for watching. That pretty much does it for this video. If you did enjoy it, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you're new. You can click on the top right corner of the screen to watch my latest video, but please be sure to freak out in the comments below because I am still freaking out. I'm super excited. It's finally happening. But I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye. I see red.